everyone, my wife and I went to Christchurch to celebrate our anniversary. Since it's a special day for us, we decided to book a luxury accommodation. But hang on, hang on, I'm a frugal person and I don't spend money if it's not worth it. But as long as the stuff I spend money on will add value to my life, then I'm happy to pay. So today I will show you our affordable luxury accommodation in Christchurch for three days and two nights. The Breeden Stables. So I'm going to show you three things. So first is our actual room. Second, I will show you the amenities or the other stuff you can enjoy in the Britain Stables. And third, I will show you why I booked our accommodation here. So let's go. Hey everyone, welcome to the Britain Stables. So this is not, this is not actually a hotel. This is, are you sure it's locked? That's a very nice tour. Um, so this is not a hotel. We just found this place in Airbnb. This is the workshop. I think they call it workshop. Our room is called V1000 Workshop. It is called workshop because it used to be the workshop of the legendary Kiwi motorcycle designer, John Britton. The room is very spacious beautiful and unique. I've checked other hotels in Christchurch, even the expensive ones, but they look pretty outdated. You pay more, but you don't feel special. Like like, like you're only getting the standard, which is not worthy of your money, if you know what I mean. But this accommodation is perfectly designed and a perfect alternative for a hotel. There is a queen size, Bed. It's very comfortable. The bed overall is smooth, soft, and relaxing. We also have two couches here. It says it can sleep a total of three guests on their website, but for our size, probably four guests are okay. So there are no kitchen facilities, but it's okay because we have no plans to cook on our short break. So that's fine. It works if you will only be eating out or have some takeaways. But if you're planning to cook, then this is not perfect for you. But even though they don't have kitchen facilities, they actually have Nespresso, complimentary coffee, tea, of course, sugar, milk, and things like that. They also have a small fridge, toaster, and a microwave. So it's perfect if you really just want to eat out like what we did. The bathroom is nicely designed as well. It has heated floors and cool mirror and you can see the floors, they're matching with the kitchen. So everything in this room complements each other. It is well thought. So the Breeden Stables also provides you shampoo, conditioner, body soap, hair dryer, bathrobe, towels, and things like that. So that's pretty much it. Now we're going outside and I'm going to show you the view from this door. Let's go. Here. So now let's talk about the amenities. They have indoor swimming pool, but for some reason it is only heated between November to April. And we booked the accommodation this month, June, so it's not heated, but it's okay because there is a spa pool heated all year round in a private garden, so it's fine. And there is also a billiard room. There is no car park on site, but there are so many car park spaces on the street. It's okay because the Breeden Stables is located in the residential area, so outside is actually quiet and it's not so busy, so you can easily find a car park outside, so that's fine. They have a well-designed exterior, so it's very perfect for photo shoot. So many other designers come to 
book their accommodation here, some do their wedding photo shoot. So really, you are paying for a well-designed luxury accommodation. So if you're like me and you're into aesthetics, good designs, then I would definitely recommend the Brilliant Stables. Before anything else, please follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube at Rainbow Believer Number One. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. In that way, you'll be notified whenever I upload new videos. And then you won't miss anything. So now, why the Breeden Stables? I cannot stress this enough. First and foremost, it is well designed. It is so well designed that the Britain Stables has been featured in the Grand Designs New Zealand. As a designer myself, staying in the Britain Stables inspired me in so many ways and it actually added value in my life. Second, it is iconic. As I mentioned in the first part, it used to be the workshop of John Britain. So to those who don't know, John Britain was a revolutionary motorbike designer. He didn't just create fast motorbikes, but also he created them beautiful with a bright pink and pearl blue aesthetics. His Britain motorcycles actually won races and set international speed records in the 90s. Imagine New Zealand winning over Ducatis and Honda, so it's very iconic. Third, the reason why I chose the Britain Stables is because it is local. It is family owned. John's daughter Isabel turned the garage into a, an incredible accommodation for public to enjoy. And lastly, it is affordable. We paid only 453 New Zealand dollars for three days and two nights. And we get to experience a well-designed, iconic, and local accommodation in Christchurch, which made our anniversary extra special. So that's all for today. Thank you for watching. I'm going to leave the link below so you can check the Britain Stables in your own time. Um, just a disclaimer, we've paid for 153 New Zealand dollars but the prices may change and they have other rooms as well that you can choose from. So yeah, just go check them out and just enjoy life. Stay blessed.